The vacant house. In the heart of a quiet suburb, nestled amidst rows of identical houses, stood a vacant one. Its windows were dark and empty, its paint peeling, its lawn overgrown. Locals whispered tales of strange occurrences within its walls, of eerie sounds and fleeting shadows. They warned against approaching the house, claiming it was haunted by a malevolent spirit. One day, a group of teenagers, fueled by curiosity and a thirst for adventure, dared to enter the house. They snuck through a broken side door, their hearts pounding with a mixture of fear and excitement. The air inside was heavy and still, the silence broken only by the creaking of floorboards beneath their feet. As they ventured deeper into the house, they felt an unsettling presence, as if they were being watched. Shadows danced in the corners of their vision, and whispers seemed to echo from the empty rooms. They pressed on, their determination growing stronger with each passing moment. They reached the attic, a dusty, cobweb-filled space filled with old furniture and forgotten belongings. A chill ran down their spines as they noticed a child's doll sitting on a shelf, its porcelain face cracked and its eyes eerily staring at them. Suddenly, a cold gust of wind swept through the room, extinguishing their flashlights and plunging them into darkness. Panic surged through them as they stumbled around, desperately trying to find their way out. A disembodied voice echoed through the darkness, its tone filled with malice and despair. The teenagers exchanged terrified glances, their voices catching in their throats. The voice grew louder, closer, and then it was right behind them, whispering their deepest fears into their ears. Overwhelmed with terror, they fled the house, scrambling out into the night. They ran until their lungs burned and their legs ached, never daring to look back. The house remained silent and empty, its secrets hidden within its walls, waiting for the next unsuspecting souls to dare to enter its domain.